Hey guys, so today we are adding a lagoon table to our Far Transit camper van. First of all, we install the aluminum mount plate into the B-pillar using the M6 screws provided with the mount plate. Then we install the sliver lagoon bracket onto the mount plate. Uh, the three M8 screws are included with the lagoon table system and they're a bit long so you could definitely use shorter screws such as uh, 30 millimeter long screws. Uh, we chose the new sliver lagoon briquette over the regular one because the footprint, footprint is much smaller uh, and the final result look much better in our opinion. The leg slides into the lagoon bracket and is secured by tightening the handle. And then I'm about to install the arm. And as you can see, I already installed the tabletop with six screws. Um, this tabletop is actually a bamboo cutting board, um, but the size and look is exactly what we're looking for. So that's a huge time saver. So we don't need to build our own. Um, on top of that, it's cheaper than making our own. So yeah, we went for it. Here, I'm just showing that the table can be positioned into the sliding door cutout. Um, I don't know, that could be useful if you're chatting and drinking outside or something. And next, um, pay attention to the wobble here. Um, the wobble comes from the B-pillar, not from the mount plate. Uh, it won't go away, so if it's an issue for you, um, please consider a different solution. Now, the driver's side is a mirror of the passenger side, um, so the installation process is exactly the same, um, except for the fact that the factory holes are not treated. So we first need to add M8 rivet nuts, uh, which are included with the driver's side mount plate. Um, you'll find ways to install rivet nuts using the DIY tool on YouTube, um, but if you're starting van conversion, I highly recommend getting the proper tool. Um, this will save you a lot of time and prevent installation issues. So now that we added the tread and inserts, uh, the remaining of the installation is exactly the same as the passenger side, so I'll leave you to it. So thanks for watching and check out the description for all the links. Happy build!